uh, getting into the space all the time. So we'll see what happens. Okay, um, yeah, that was good back air. Uh, okay, I can see the side of the intention. So, like, this stage is really big, so Sonic's gonna get a lot of room to run around. Um, so, Gibbs gonna have to make sure he's aware of uh, the stage itself, the moving platforms. Uh, Sonic is just a different case compared to other characters like Fox. Like, it's gonna be hard to get a hit, especially the fact that uh, Sonic's probably one of the hardest characters for Marth to get all these guaranteed tipper ranges on. Uh, not guaranteed as in like tech chase guaranteed, guaranteed as in like neutral, like even like a tilt or a forward air tipper. It's going to be a little bit harder to get on Sonic just because of like his unpredictability. Because um, even at like higher levels, even though players start to know what Sonic can do, he's still the fastest, has the fastest dash speed in the game. And uh, yeah, so like stuff like that you're definitely going to see too. Like Sonic is so fast, he can eat, uh, the second he sees a knockdown, he can compliment off of it. So um, yeah. It, I mean, Drag's working pretty well on his Sonic. I think a lot of his tech's really good. And it's really cool to see. Like, you know, we saw Xion before. He doesn't play as much. Uh, but it's cool to have, like, both these Sonic players here today. And uh, Gibbs has been leveling up a lot, uh, especially in Melee. Uh, I think he's just, you know, playing PO just you know, here today. And he's a good supporter in the community. And I think he's just, like, playing games. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Oh wow, is that gonna yeah. Hey, we should do this Thanks for tuning in to KC Game On. We're gonna have another one late in July, so definitely check us out then. And if you're in the area, Kansas City or Midwest, definitely come to that tournament. Just look it up, Casey Game On. They have all the dates for all of 2017. Two, and we're going to be one, here every time. Go. All right, got some battlefield. Um, I like this stage for Marth. It's definitely a little more compact compared to Delfino's Secret. So Marth has a lot more um, of the stage that he can use to control it, the opponent in terms of range. Uh, as you can see, your Gibbs actually looking pretty good. Uh oh, make sure. All right, <laughs> gets back on the stage. Um, Drag's playing some good mind games. Sonic's a tricky character. Um, that's actually an archetype people don't like look into as much as the tricky characters. So there are characters like if you ever play like Mario Tennis, which is ironically the song that's playing. There's an archetype called Tricky, and it's like when they hit the ball, like it, it's just like these curve shots and it's like it's just being unpredictable. And there are certain characters in Smash that are just tricky, like so Sonic would be one, um, U2 would be a tricky character. There's just these characters that have these kind of like edge of unpredictability and definitely those type of characters have that. Um, so yeah, it, especially for Marth that really wants to have a good mid-range control of the match, it's going to be hard for him to go against not only a character that's tricky, but a character that has the fastest dash speed in the game and all these mix-up options. Um, and like as you can see, Drag knows a bunch of like gimping setups on Marth and basically anyone. That was a good patient wait by Drag. Oh, miss. So that's the thing about Sonic. Uh, homing attack is good, but if you miss it and you're in the air, you go into helpless state. So what he did there is homing attack went to the left fell off with helpless state. Okay, good uh, wave dashing by Gib just to set up, like, basically pivoting himself to, to, you know, set his positioning up so that he can get a more uh, favorable hit in if uh, Drag was going to approach him head on. Okay, I, that, I think the attempt was correct for the forward smash, it's just Drag was too far away on that platform. Oh yeah, that's from Brawl. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Alright, so Marth still has the big grab range though, and so definitely uh, a good asset for him and in this matchup where Sonic might try to run away certain times in neutral. That's two SDs. Um, let's see what happens. Ooh, good thing he didn't hit that spring. That was good spacing by Gib. Oh, goes right into the dancing blade. 